thanks. Now to this dry weather. It has been so dry around here that tonight some people are dealing with wells that have dried up. If this has happened to you, what do you do? News A's Josh Scheinblum talked with some experts about next steps. Josh. And in Darren, it might seem a little ironic that we're doing a story about a drought as it's raining outside. But rest assured, while this is a good start, we certainly need a lot more of it. In fact, if you plan on going outside using your hose, maybe watering some plants, that water is about to get a whole lot more valuable if it isn't already, because the state has issued a warning that we are in a state of drought. In the rural parts of Connecticut, it doesn't take people long to realize when there's a drought. Where I walk, I can see that the water level is real low, where there I know there had been water trickling through. Where I work, there's a river that goes by, and that's really, really low. Knowing the signs of dry conditions underneath the surface, however, is a little less known. You want to make sure that all the bolts are in the well cap and that they're all tight. That's where Roger Craig comes in. He's the owner of a company that specializes in servicing water wells. And with abnormally dry conditions outside, he's found himself very busy. We probably had six or seven calls in the last week. Um, one guy called today, he's a regular customer in Watertown, his well's dry. I've got another customer over here uh, in Southford, his well is dry. So yeah, we're starting to see the increase in calls. In periods where there's been a shortage of precipitation, Craig says, if you depend on well water, it's important you keep a close eye on your water usage. Hand dug or older model shallow wells that rely on water close to the surface are the most vulnerable to running dry. The first thing I tell everybody is don't water the lawn. That's, that's the number one thing. Uh, let Mother Nature take care of the lawn. If it gets brown during the summer, it'll come back in the fall. Craig says most modern wells that pump up water from deep within the earth are less likely to go dry, but nevertheless, he also recommends well owners pay close attention to their home water pressure. If it's low, the well might be going dry. The best thing to do is go down, shut the pump off, and then give a, a qualified well or pump te technician a call and have them come in and, and check the system out for you. Specifically, officials with the state are calling this a drought advisory, and they're also asking people to pay close attention to what your local city leaders are saying, because if they make calls for water conservation locally, they think that you should follow them. For now, we're live in New Haven, Josh Scheinblum, News 8.